Hey, 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 collective. Thank y'all so much for being here, tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is. I am your girl, Bucky. And this, of course, is Sip This Tea Tarot, where we tap in with spirit and get the tea on your situation or whatever it is spirit needs for you to know at this time. Collective, all of the messages here, they are general, meaning they cannot and will not resonate with each and every one of you guys. So please, only take what resonates with you and your story and leave the rest. Also, anything you need to know about myself or my channel, it will be in the description box below. And of course, I don't own any of the rights to the music that you guys may happen to hear in the background. It's simply playing for us to vibe out to. So collective, if you can hear it, most definitely get your vibe on. All right, y'all. We just about to tap in. Like every time I light my sage and it goes to burning, like, because usually I can light my sage and I barely get any smoke coming off of it, right? I happen to light my sage, so I was clearing out the energy uh, in my room, and it got to, like, blaze, and I mean, like, blaze and, like, actually catching on fire. So, that says to me that there's a lot of heavy energy in the, uh, in, you know, with the general collective. Also, I keep hearing the, um, the song that Nardo Wick again, Who Won't Smoke With Me? Who Won't Smoke With Me? <laughs> like, yeah, Who Won't Smoke With Us? Like, yeah. So I'm just going to tap in with Spirit and see what that part is about. We're going to start out with the uh, Urban Tarot. Holy Spirit. Yeah, you can have like a, uh, three people coming against you. Because I see the Three of Cups and the Power card. So a lot of y'all can have three people coming against you. You could be a water sign or an earth sign. Or, you know, y'all take the energy how it resonates. Shit, these could be... The signs of the people that's coming towards you. So let's let's just tap in and see. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Can you give me more on this situation here? Can you give me more on this situation? Oh. Again, thank y'all for being here with me. Tuning in. Allow me to read for you guys. It is always my pleasure. Yeah, see, we got the magician on the bottom of the deck. So it's like somebody here is trying to make plans. Somebody's trying to figure something out. Yeah, we got the magician completion and the three of swords. like with the universe on the bottom of the deck a lot of y'all just like y'all get blessings after blessings after blessing and this fit it's like somebody trying to figure out how to how to make this end for you i don't know why though this could even be somebody trying to do some type of magic on y'all but the universe is stepping in has stepped in a long time ago and it's like no this is no not on not not on my child type energy here like, this person is trying to figure out why everything that they're trying to do to you is not working. It's because you have the universe on your side. I don't know why it took me so long to get that out. Yeah, it's like everything this person trying to do to you is going down the drain collective. <laughs> yeah, every time this person go against you, I'm feeling like it just end up like backfiring on them. Because you see how like you had those ones going out. But if it's looking like those are coming back, it's like every time they send something your way, it come back to them. And somebody here is trying to figure out why it's not working. This is possibly a person who feels like they're very, very powerful. Like they have like some kind of gift here. And they're used to actually doing this to people and it's working. But on you collective, it's not working. And this person cannot figure out why her... <laughs> Yeah, it's like four, three. It's like, it's digressing. Like, less and less and less. Nothing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Holy Spirit. <clears throat> Excuse me. Give me more on this situation. Dang, y'all, my cards are okay. Y'all, do y'all see this? I can't. The cards won't even shuffle. Okay, yeah, we got the Ten of Cups, the Eight of Cups. In the two of wands. Hmm. It's 
seriously feeling like her. Somebody here is like trying to make somebody walk away from their family here. Like this person is trying to control the situation. I don't know what this is. This could be like a third party here that's trying to do this because something between them and someone else has completed. It's like this person felt like they were going to have a family with, uh, with someone and this person walked away. Now this person is like trying to control the situation possibly with some type of magic here. Somebody here could also be pregnant <clears throat> and somebody's trying to get the uh the 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 uh the father of your child to walk away from you. Hmm. Also here somebody here was trying to get somebody here pregnant. But it's like you walked away just in the nick of time before it actually happened because this person was pretty much just trying to get you pregnant to control you. Like to like I said, control the situation. Yeah, look, Emperor. Aries energy here. Gemini. Aries. I'm feeling. Yeah, but it's, it, this is... <laughs> It's a few different stories out here. But somebody here is definitely, most definitely trying to con uh, control the situation. Somebody here is worried because whatever they're trying to do to you, it's not working with the disappointment card on the bottom of the deck. I don't know if y'all can see that. I'm trying. But yeah, it's like they're worried here. Why are they worried though, Spirit? Why are they worried? It's kind of like somebody is figuring out that somebody is like doing magic or doing some type of work on them or something. Could be a water sign or a fire sign. Gemini. I'm feeling like Pisces as well. Yeah, it's feeling like somebody's possibly doing like some kind of candle magic or a uh, moon magic here. Somebody even could be doing like a blood ritual. It's this is some type of somebody here could even be trying to males tap in because somebody here could even be trying to get pregnant by y'all like purposely. It's like to gain some type of control over a third party situation. This person is trying to purposely get pregnant. Somebody here is also worried about whether or not they can have children. Hmm. Somebody here could also be worried about if they're the father of somebody's child, y'all. Wow. Yeah, because somebody is like, if I'm not the father of that child, then I, <clears throat> I'm walking away. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, this is this is the... <laughs> But see, I don't see that this is going to work. You see what I'm saying? Because honestly here, I see somebody getting that, that cycle. Somebody could be telling somebody that they like three to five months pregnant. And then they, they're having their, their cycle here. They're doing all this just to control this situation. Yeah, somebody's going to be really disappointed when they figure this out. Oh, it just flew on the floor, y'all. Yeah, we got fortitude in the reverse. Yeah, somebody is not going to stick around and stick this out whenever this uh this truth comes to light, y'all. Yeah, high priestess. Whenever this truth comes to light, somebody is not going to stick around. They're going to be out of there. It's like a baby carriage in this picture, y'all. The carriage upside down, see what I'm saying? Somebody here is strictly, they like trying to keep somebody with them through a, with a baby. Somebody here is also pretending to be someone that they're not. Let me tell y'all why I say that. Because we got the costume designer Strife and the High Priestess here. High Priestess, Strife. 
costume designer. Somebody here is pretending to be someone that they're not. It's like someone here is pretending to be uh, very spiritual, even possibly a high priestess, possibly a water sign here. Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. It's feeling like this person is doing this just to try to be like someone else. Yeah, this third party here is doing all of this just to uh, try to be more like the real high priestess here. It's like they're in competition with the real high priestess, y'all. So, yeah, this person could use a pregnancy here to keep your person from walking away from them because they know that your person want to walk away from them, possibly. But I'm telling you, this person here, they going to figure this out. If, even if it's like this person pregnant, this part, uh, this this uh, masculine may not be the father of their child. And once this masculine figure this out, it's going to be a done deal with the fortitude in reverse. I don't see it moving forward at all, especially with the three of uh, swords and the, um, the completion card being out here. Yeah, somebody is worried about this. I'm telling you, somebody is worried. It's like somebody is uh, in mental conflict, like very, very bad. Yeah, it's like somebody is telling somebody that they're pregnant, but this person don't even know if they can have kids. Hmm. Let's keep going. Let's see if we We got a few of them popping out, child. Yeah. We got the A in the reverse. You see what I'm saying here? And the Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, six of Swords and the uh, Nine of Pentacles game. See, this is what I'm saying. It's feeling like somebody is doing all of this to try to get somebody to uh, reconcile with them, y'all. Earth sign, air sign. We have uh, fire out here. We have pretty much everybody. So y'all just take the energy how it resonates. Don't focus on the sign. Just listen to the message. Somebody out here is seriously, they're either telling somebody that they're pregnant to get somebody to come back to them or stay with them, or this person is pregnant, but they're not sure who the father of their child is here. Somebody here, I'm seeing them like sit up. It's like they're, uh, I'm seeing somebody sit up and count like the days that they cycle or something like that. There's an air sign here, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It can, um, I don't know if you've like gained uh, a lot of weight here lately, but if so, spirit is directing you to get your heart checked. It's something about, um, your heart that you need to get checked out. This is specifically for someone who's been gaining like a lot of weight and you don't know where this weight is coming from. Also, whomever that has this plan to keep somebody with them with the uh with a baby or something like that, the universe is not on their side. With especially with the Aeon in the in the reverse. 3D, 5D, like the universe is not supporting this at all. Yeah, it's also feeling like somebody out here, I don't know if you have like um like you have a, a, a spiritual gift where you can just like see into the future or something like that. It's feeling like you're in conflict with yourself, with your intuition for some reason. Hmm. Yeah, there could be a fire sign involved in here. It's like you fighting with what you know. And possibly what you feel makes you happy. You possibly, in the back of your mind, you know that there's a third party going on, whomever this is I'm speaking to. Yeah, look, we got works in the tower. Works is in the reverse. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody here could also have lost a job here, and you worried about, you know, like, your financial stability, you know, how you're going to make it from day to day. With the universe card that we saw at the beginning, don't worry about that because your daily, uh, all of your needs will be met. 
So yeah, come out of conflict about that. Yeah, the universe is on your side. Yeah, with the um works and the tower here, this is what I'm saying. Whomever this is with this plan right here, it's not gonna work. This could definitely be a water sign or an air sign here. And with the I mean with the tower, you know we have Aquarius. As well as Scorpio and Aries. You see what I'm saying? But any... um, I'm feeling any water sign, any air sign. And a uh, fire as well with the light in the back. But it's like whomever has this plan, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. Also, if you are the one with like this, um, this health problem with your heart, I feel like suddenly you're going to have to stop working here. Yeah, it's it's feeling like and it's some it's like somebody out here is wondering like something is going on with somebody's menstrual cycle. I don't know if it's like excess bleeding here or if you're having like stabbing pains, you know, in um in your um reproductive regions, like your ovaries, your uterus, your cervix, something like that. Yeah, somebody could be having like this, um, like an irregular discharge. You see what I'm saying? Spirit is advising you to get that checked out. Someone here has also lost multiple children. Spirit is asking you to go get that checked out as well because, yeah, you do want to have children in the future. So it's important for you to get that checked out now. Hmm. But let's keep going. Yeah, victory. Go get that checked out now. So in the long run, you can have whatever it is that you want. Yeah, go get it checked out, child. Don't wait. Yeah, we got virtue right behind it. Climbing up that ladder. Yeah, going toward what you want. The Holy Spirit can keep me going. Yeah, we got the, the Ten of Wands, Oppression here. Mm. I'm also feeling like here, somebody could be cheating somebody out of some money here. I don't know if this is your job and like they don't want to give you your last paycheck or something like that. Or if somebody is just going through like a lot of um like financial instability because you can't find steady work. Thank you, Holy Spirit. So you feeling like really um uh, like burdened. You see what I'm saying? It's like you got a lot of bills. Like I see this as a lot of bills like piling up, and you know you bills instead of coming in, coming in, coming. Some of this is causing some of y'all a lot of stress here. With the Queen of Swords here, it's time to cut that stress out because it's starting to affect your heart. Yeah, air sign, earth sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Holy Spirit, give me more. Yeah, Pisces right here. Yeah, it's like steady work is not... Yeah, mm. Yeah, we got the justice as well. Libra energy. It's feeling like something here is like somebody is being blinded to the truth about somebody. It's like somebody is actually right now allowing themselves to be controlled. Even though whatever situation this is that they're in, it's like nothing but conflict or back and forth like type energy. Arguing shit like that. It's not working. But somebody is staying stuck here. That's what I'm saying. Somebody is using either pregnancy or a child to keep somebody stuck somewhere. Mm, mm, mm. They just fall. Yeah. Ace of Wands. 
with the oppression and the ace of ones, it's really feeling like somebody is like doing something to purposely keep somebody from their new beginning here. And this is absolutely crazy. This could even be a new job. What the hell? Holy Spirit. What is this about the... Did y'all see that fly? Yeah, the rock star. <clears throat> it flew way over here. Knight of Wands. But see, straight up, like for real, tap in. Because I see that somebody's... You got to, whatever this work situation is, <clears throat> excuse me, y'all, whatever the situation here is, period, with the Justice card and the Knight of Wands and the Ace of Wands, I see that some, it's a new beginning coming towards you like fast, quick. I'm, look, I'm just telling y'all, somebody here could be doing magic on y'all with the High Priestess and the Magician here in the tower. And then we got interference on the bottom of the deck. So a lot of y'all could be uh, experiencing some type of like um, like internet interference, Wi-Fi, your cable, um, shit, just like uh, energetic interference. Like you can't get your mind right, your mind all over the place. Shit like that, you know, like you just confused. It's possibly somebody out here throwing magic at y'all. This could have something to do with a third party. Holy Spirit, what's going on with this third party? Yeah, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person is taking action. So I'm telling you, <clears throat> excuse me. Some of y'all were dealing with somebody, yeah, and they, they third, they person, whomever that, that third party is. This person here is taking action towards you. Yeah, whatever they doing, it may work for a minute, but I don't see it working like too long you see what i'm saying but they just keep throwing they like they figure it ain't working so they throw it again they figure it ain't working so they throw it again shit like that yeah and we got the knight of disc knight of pentacles didn't i tell you what they was doing it ain't working everything slow like stagnant it ain't working they, the, the person they want to come back to them ain't coming. The shit they trying to do to you ain't working. This person here, yeah, could be a Gemini here or a water sign with the two of cups, the love cord. This person doing all of this behind some type of love situation. And it ain't working. <laughs> it's simply not working. Ain't nothing working. Yeah, look. Look, the sun, Leo energy, cruelty. It's like, I'm telling you, somebody here is taking some shit out on their kids as well because some shit ain't working out in their love life. Yeah, it could be a, a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, we do got Leo right here. Or this could be somebody, somebody dealing with. Y'all take the energy how it resonates. Yeah, Sagittarius right here, Wheel of Fortune. It's like... <laughs> Oh, yeah, mercy. Yeah, we got the Wheel of Fortune on the bottom of the deck, though. I'm telling you, some of y'all financial situations is about to turn around and y'all don't even see this. All you have to do is put your trust in the universe. Yeah, it could be a Virgo here. Somebody is also looking into y'all finances, so y'all be real careful. It's a lot going down out here. Now I see why that sage was burning like it was collective. Yeah, it's a lot going on out here, but we gonna leave it right there because it can keep going and going and going, y'all. But if the video resonates, please like, comment, as well as subscribe, y'all, and we'll get back up.